Could this crowding which we have right now be avoided? Hello everyone, a very good morning. I am Dr. Chirag Chamarya and I am an oral and maxillofacial surgeon practicing with Royal Dental Clinics since the past four years. So friends, I would like to talk about a very common question which I have been asked by my patients is could this crowding which we have right now be avoided? Could we have done something in the earlier age? Could our parents have done something? Can we do something for our children to avoid crowding of their teeth or mismatch or malalignment of their teeth? Friends, dentistry in the younger ages called as pediatric dentistry has evolved now and in this evolution of pediatric dentistry we have seen that most of these malalignments or mismatches could have been managed very well at a younger age. During the growth phase, our tooth erupts, our jaw enlarges and there is space created. Say in your milk tooth stage when you have primary teeth, if you had a lot of cavities and at that point of time, you did not get those cavities restored. Automatically, the amount of space available for your permanent teeth to come reduces and hence there is a higher chance of crowding. Using very simplistic methods of a composite built up or a retainer or a space maintainer, this could have been avoided. There are intraoral appliances which have to be applied for not more than one or two months at a time and they could have easily prevented a lower jaw enlarging more than the upper jaw. Friends, at the earlier ages, it is very much possible to use techniques of preventive and interceptive orthodontics wherein we do not allow a certain, method, a certain eruption cycle or we assist a certain eruption cycle to happen. Hence, it is always advisable that from the first tooth which erupts in your child, you should always have a dental visit and then continue that dental visit at least twice a year till the permanent dentition is not erupted. After which only a maintenance visit should is advised. Thank you.